Hello everyone. Welcome to ITPK. In today's video, we will learn how to deploy a web app linked to a Windows devices from Microsoft Intune. Intune supports variety of app types including web apps. A web app is a client server application. A server provides the web apps which includes the user interface, content and functionality. Additionally, modern hosting platform provides security, load balancing and other features. You can use Microsoft Intune to point to this web app type. From Intune, we can also assign the specific group of people that needs to be access this web app. But before we need to manage and assign the web apps to our user, we need to add this app to Intune and deploy from Intune to the Windows computer and also to company portal app. Intune will create a shortcut of web app for user device. For Windows devices, just will create a shortcut in the start menu here. So you must be global administrator or Intune service administrator to deploy this web app. Login to Intune using the URL intune.microsoft.com and then go to apps. In app section, we are targeting here Windows. Let's go to Windows. In the Windows app, let's go ahead and add the app and in the type, we will select a web link because we are deploying Windows web app and hit select. Before hitting select, you can see all details here, right? Let it select. Here, we need to enter the name of web app. So let's suppose that web app name will be IPBK. We can say IPBK tutorials. In the description and publisher is ITPK and enter the valid URL ITPK.com. Right. Currently, I don't have a blog uh, for my ITPK channel, but here, just to explain you, I am explaining that we could enter this web app and details here. Right. Required a managed browser to open this link. Yes, we will require a managed browser to open this, and this link will open in Intune protected browser such as Microsoft Edge. Right, this is the Microsoft browser, and this setting will apply to Android and iOS devices. In the category section, we can select the categories for category for our this app and I want to select here computer management. I want to show this as a feature app in company portal. Yes. So currently I don't have all this URL information, privacy developer or the owner. Right. So let's scroll down and it's asking to upload an image. And let's find ITPK image in my computer as a logo. I have created just a temporary logo for my this video to explain you. Okay, here you go. Let me select this logo and hit OK. Now I've entered all these information just to explain you, right? I'm again repeating that you can add all these information according to your requirement, right? Hit next. In the assignment section, we have three types here. Required, available for enrolled devices or available with or without enrollment and also one more option is uninstalled right so here i will use the required option that everyone 
is required to get this app on their devices and this will be automatically set up on their devices in the start menu as well as the company portal or we can add a specific group right for which this app is required right so let's find out any group here admin docs got it this is needed for admin hit next and now we are at the point where we can view all the information of our web app that we have set up earlier and we are ready here to create so it's saving this application for me and this will take few seconds that's perfect application is created application ID gets created successfully a few seconds ago okay so once you have created this application this will time to deploy on computer devices and this will appear in start menu here first right and also this app will appear in company portal of the users or group that we have added to this specific web app configuration in the property section i can show you we have added this admin dos group that will get this itvk web app right and once this is deployed on the user you will uh, you will be able to monitor the status of device install here and the user install here in microsoft in june so that concludes the video of creating web app in Microsoft in June and deploy to a user or a group of users. And we can monitor this app deployment from monitor section here that which devices have an installed status and the user install status. And also this app will appear in company portal of the user. So that's it about today's video. We have learned how to deploy a web app from Microsoft in June. I hope you have enjoyed the simple and step by step process. Again, I will repeat that all these information which I have entered during the setup of this web app are for your learning. You can add all these information according to your requirement, right? You can enter the web app link that is required by your company or you need that and logo and all these information that you are required to set up thanks for watching keep watching keep sharing and don't forget to subscribe take care bye